I'm sure you've seen this statue before because Afrocentrists won't stop talking about it and they use it as their winning card whenever they want to prove that ancient Egyptians were black. So let's debunk it and ruin it for them. This is one of the two Ka statues of Tutankhamun. The Ka was essentially a person's double. It was the life force and at death it was separated from the body. According to the Met Museum, Ka statues were created for the deceased to be used in the funerary cult and to make him present after death to accept offerings. They were usually made in black to be associated with Osiris, the Egyptian god of the underworld and the judge of the dead. And because the black represented death, the underworld and fertility, which is the reason why ancient Egypt was called Kemet, meaning the black land because of its fertile soil. So basically these two black statues of Tutankhamun were just symbolic and they don't represent his skin color. As you can see here, the black color of the statue looks so unrealistic compared to the skin color of the Egyptian worker holding it. Not to mention the other statues and depictions of King Tutankhamun with the same orange brown color of millions of ancient and modern Egyptians. In addition to the fact that Tutankhamun wasn't the only person that had a black Ka statue even though he wasn't black, but also Menshehadep II, Ka Aper, and Thutmose I, and many others. 